Hello everyone and welcome back to British Retire. So, so in my past video, once I was asking how to pass certain level of Senkaimon or Tower Audios and I got a lot of help with people watching the video. So as everybody knows, there is a new Senkaimon quest coming, which is not coming, already came this week. And uh, I found some levels are quite challenging. For example, uh, this bonus level of level 47 which is 2 out of 5 this one obviously it says the condition is captain a finish only but there is hazard or paralyzed and also asking for speed capture so obviously like you can see it's benefits the wide biakuya and uh, for those people they don't have biakuya like me and it would be pretty tough to pass this because there is paralyzed hazard everywhere so after struggling for a while, actually I figured out a way actually pretty easy to pass the level even you don't have 10 10 10 link, you don't have wide AP Aquia, but you can still do it. So in order to say my thank you for everybody who helped me the past, I want to share this video with you and I hope you find this video helpful. So the character I use in this level actually is the OG Kaname. Yeah, as you see like the configuration here is has no zero link slot, but what I did is Senkaisen, Senkaimon Aizen, put there, and also put the resurrected Ichigo there because he gave 55% deduction of paralyzed duration, also gives some strong attack recharge. And for the accessories, I just put some hollow bites and uh, for the vacation pills, and also I put this one, Manju. So this, because this one gave another fifty percent of paralyzed re duration re re reduction, also give uh, for the second effect I just put forty percent stamina. So with fifty five percent of paralyzed reduction in the accessory and uh, fifty five percent paralyzed reduction for Ichigo, so this kind of becomes mutable to paralyze. And also his killer skill is Soul Reaper, and in this quest, all every enemies they are Soul Reapers. So, even his OG character, but uh, actually this is time for this Kaname to shine. Shining Kaname! Okay, so that's enough talking. Let me put in this Kaname into the real test, and I'll show you how easy, easy this quest became. Obviously I want to use a strong attack, because I'm immutable for... See, everybody just die fast. Immutable for paralyzed, so I just walk like everybody like a butter. Of course, because I'm using Kaizen Link, I have to make sure I, I don't don't be hit. Otherwise, I lose a lot of damage. His first round attack is pretty good. It's a launch forward. I use a lot, and uh, because his his soul tray was strong attack recharge as second soul tray, I find that quite useful. So in this case, his strong attack combat pretty easy. Come on! Oh, don't hit me! Almost, almost. Actually, I'm a bit slow on this run. Because I'm using Kaizen Link, so that means his normal attack is not totally waste. I don't know if he has the Pelletator for confusing, but confusing is not useful at all. So I don't really mind. Oh, actually I'm running time already. Ah, uh, this is not a fail. That's a fail. It's sort of strong attack, you have to be really close. 
Oh, no. Okay. So this second left for the boss Yorichi. Hopefully it's enough for me. I think she's fine. Just wait for a strong to come back and then I'm sure we'll be able to finish that Yorichi. Come on! See? That's easy. Cut down Yorichi like butter. So that's my experience about how to pass this level. You don't need a fancy character. You don't need a fancy like golden chabi or golden yuki. And you don't need any leg slot, but you can still make it. Hopefully you found this video is helpful. And thank you very much for your time for watching. And see you. Have a good night.